Welcome to Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2019's Ground War mode and uh, my video about comparing Modern Warfare Ground War with Battlefield 4. Lots of people would consider Battlefield 4 the last great Battlefield. Now I don't particularly agree with that. Battlefield, War, Battlefield 4 was a great game, don't get me wrong. However, I do believe that Battlefield 1 was a lot more fun and a better game, uh, more of an emotional uh, experience, and more of more of a. Um, it's going to sound a bit odd here, but more of a game where it was more of a military sim than Battlefield 4. Now I know Battlefield 1 isn't a military sim, but I thought Battlefield 4 was much more of a sandbox. We could do all these crazy things, like attach C4 to jeeps and then drive them into <laughs> tanks and do stuff like that. And you couldn't do that in Battlefield 1. But I thought that I think that made Battlefield 1 better. But that doesn't take away from the fact that Battlefield 4 was a really great Battlefield. I enjoyed it an awful lot. And coming back and playing it again to record this footage was a real eye-opener and the fact that this game is you know several years old now but lots of people are still playing it this is on console this is on PlayStation not on PC and it still looks amazing and comparing Conquest in um, Battlefield 4 with Ground War in the new Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2019 and I think what's really special about both these games is that they fed off um, each other over the years the Call of Duty franchise and the Battlefield franchise and we've kind of come full circle because if you were to ask me to describe Modern Warfare's Ground War mode to a Battlefield player I would say right just imagine a Battlefield 4 map with everything that goes on all the Battlefield moments and the jets coming over and the helicopters and the tanks driving around imagine that with 32 versus 32 so you've got 64 players and then squash it into an area half the size squish it up <laughs> but you've still got all that chaos going on but all happening in a much smaller place and that my friends is what ground war is which makes it brilliant <laughs> in my opinion ground war isn't battlefield all right it's call of duty's take on battlefield but but it's very different because you've still got kill streaks coming in um, you've still got um, the Call of Duty uh, engine running game, so it very much feels like Call of Duty. Um, but we've got all these battlefield elements and battlefield moments that happen. You know, those things where you see a helicopter spinning out of control upside down and smashing into a tank, or a jet coming in. Now, I know you can't control the jets in, well, you can't directly fly the jets in ground war, but, you know, when you're calling the skill. Uh, a kill streak and the A10 Thunderbolt comes in or the Harrier comes in it is really good cool and you can control the helicopters can't you you can control the door gunner and I think the assault helicopter you have very basic control over that as well now what you can't get away with get away from is the fact that the ground war maps are much smaller the ground war map is much smaller than you know a typical battlefield map and you can see with this footage kind of thing so you don't have the room to manoeuvre like you do in Battlefield. And at the moment anyway, in the beta, one of the big problems I feel is that the snipers in Call of Duty are very much overpowered. They're one-shot kill snipers. Which means that if you're out in the open and running along, chances are you're going to get one-shot zapped by a sniper. Um, which isn't great. In Battlefield what they tend to do is they, they balance that by still having powerful sniper rifles but if you want a one shot kill you have to hit them in the head um, and Call of Duty has a lot stronger aim assist I feel as well um, but they still have those same clutch moments I don't know whether there's anything in this particular gameplay where, where that happens but you know when you're on a flag and they're all piling in and your squads all piling in and you're shooting each other the grenades going off the bodies are going down and it's very very exciting as well so I think if you're a Battlefield 4 fan as long as you can get past the chaos <laughs> and kind of um, embrace the chaos that happens in Call of Duty, you'll really start to enjoy Ground War. And especially, the th thing I'd say as well is, I wouldn't just buy Modern Warfare 2019 for Ground War, you know, you know, don't that, because especially at the moment, we don't really know what 
other maps we're going to have. Um, I think there's a uh, 20 versus 20 uh, more urban city map um, that YouTubers got to play uh, earlier on in the year. Um, but what is true about Modern Warfare 2019 is the team deathmatch and the domination are all really solid game modes. They all feel good to play. Um, and the new gunfight game mode as well, where it's 2v2, funnily enough, is really great fun as well. Um, now some people are saying that this uh, Call of Duty is a little bit more clunky than previous ones, and it's definitely more clunky than uh, the Treyarch uh, Black Ops um, uh, uh, parts of the franchise. But you know, I think I think we've got a good, solid Call of Duty that has taken loads and loads of influence from what you're seeing here. You know, um, Battlefield 4. There we go. And, uh, so you, you can't go wrong, really, in my opinion, for that side. Now, is it as good as Battlefield 1? No. Is it very chaotic? Yes. <laughs> um, will you get frustrated? Yes. But the big advantage that, Call of, that uh, Call of Duty's Ground War has is the incredibly fast respawn time. So if you do die to a cheesy death to a missile coming in or an uh, airstrike or a one-shot kill sniper, it doesn't matter that much because in a couple of in about two seconds you can be back in the fight right in there you know enjoying it again you, you know you can see how fast it is here whereas with battlefield there's much more of a delay between when you die and when you get back into the action and sometimes on the bigger maps if your team are struggling to capture any flags it can be a really long delay that way um, so there we go battlefield's conquest in battlefield 4 versus modern warfare's ground war they're a lot more similar than you think and in fact again I would describe ground war as battlefield 4 condensed battlefield 4 distilled it's the essence of battlefield 4 squashed into a smaller space anyway that's enough from me if you've enjoyed the video hit like if you want to see more of the same press subscribe I'll just let the gameplay play don't worry you don't have to listen to me talk for 25 minutes so you may maybe you can enjoy the retro feel of I think this is Hainan Resort isn't it doesn't it look amazing it looks absolutely amazing this game and uh, yeah and I'll see you all again soon
Take cover! 